I promise you, the president has a big stick. <laughs> but the Taoiseach knows a lot about it. His mom uh, lived in, uh, in Long Island for 10 years or so. Uh, God rest her soul. And uh, um, although she's, wait, your mom's still, your mom's still alive as your dad passed. <laughs> God bless her soul. <laughs> I got to get this straight the number one job facing the middle class, and it happens to be, as Barack says, a three-letter word, jobs, J-O-B-S, jobs. Uh, uh, Chuck Graham, state senator's here. Chuck, stand up, Chuck, let him see you. Oh, God love you. What am I talking about? I tell you what, you're making everybody else stand up, though, pal. Thank you very, very much. You can tell I'm new. Good to see you, buddy. The largest growth in population is Indian Americans moving from India. You cannot go to a 7-Eleven or a Dunkin' Donuts unless you have a slight Indian accent. So fully, I'm not joking. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States of America, Barack Obama. <laughs> now is the time to heed the timeless advice from Teddy Roosevelt, speak softly and carry a big stick, end of quote. I promise you, the President has a big stick. <laughs> I promise you. I just want you to know I had permission to hug Lonnie. I mean, he, he, he had permission. I, I, uh, I don't know, man. I know I get criticized. I'm told I get criticized by the new left. I have the most progressive record of anybody running for the United if anybody who would run. I didn't mean 